What's going on guys, it's your boy DPJ here today with another Destiny video and in today's Destiny video I'm going to showcase to you guys my friend's level 34 Titan, that is right, it's a level 34 already and he actually obtained this a few hours after the House of Wolves dropped, it's absolutely crazy, I'm not going to even lie to you guys, I'm not too far behind him, by the end of today I'm guaranteed to be a level 34, it's as simple as that, uh, but in this video I'm going to showcase to you guys his character, the armors he used and leveled up and the few of his weapons he obtained today but before we get into the video if I could ask you guys to leave a like it really does help out and I appreciate the support but getting straight into it you can see he's got a light level 42 helmet which what he did was before we even got into the house of wolves he ascended all his pre-existing exotics then we ran the nightfall and this morpho got an ephemeric light straight away which he used on his spearhead type 0 vanguard chest armors which took him straight up to a level 33 paired with a light level 42 to helm it. We then ran the level 28 Prison of Elders because you need to do this to unlock level 32 and 34 and 35. This Morpho got the Galahorn from the level 28 straight away. How lucky is that? His first exotic weapon from the Prison of Elders, he got the Morpho in Galahorn. So we ran level 28, we unlocked the level 32 which we ran, did it pretty quickly to be honest, and he got an armor core which he used to buy the Cow Slayer's Grips from Valix the Loyal. Now he offers these for the Titans this week, they are their gauntlets. Not too keen on the look of them to be honest, but these took him up to a level 33 and a half. We then sweated the level 34 Prison of Elders, and I mean sweated. We was on room 5 for literally about an hour, we just couldn't couldn't grasp what we needed to do to defeat that giant knight who kept burning the fucking floor. We had to keep jumping, it was crazy. But we got there in the end because I clutched it like a bus and that video will come on my channel pretty soon. So for completing the level 34 Prison of Elders, we were rewarded an Aferic Light, which he used to upgrade his Force for Grieve leg armors, taking him to a light level 34. And that's basically how we did it in the first day, within the first few hours. A Nightfall, a couple of Prison of Elders, and an armor core, it's as simple as that. Now the weapons he's got, you can see he has the Wolf Slayer's Claw, which he brought from Valix the Loyal also, because when you complete the level 34 Prison of Elders, you get an armor core and a weapon core. He used the weapon core to buy this weapon. You can also see as well, he's got the Violator 12, which is a new Monarchy Sniper Rifle, one I'm gonna buy today. He got this from a package, the Lucky Son of a Bitch, and then you can see his Galahorn, the 365 attack version, which he got from the level 28 Prison of Elders. But yep, guys, that is it. That is my mate's level 34 Titan, which he reached in a few hours. Now, in my personal opinion, I would say it's a little easy for people to reach that light level 34 already, but I'm sure Bungie had this planned. I mean, they've made it quite easy, and I'm sure this was their plan, especially with the Trials of Osiris coming this Friday, where light level does matter and does count. There's going to be loads of level 34s running around everywhere, including me. But guys, what level are you? Are you a level 32 still, level 33 or a level 34? Also tell me down below what you got for your first loot drop in the prison of Elders. Thanks for stopping by as always. Do drop a like, I do appreciate the support and peace out until next time. Peace!